G'day everyone. I just wanted to do a quick video today on the Rubella apple, which is a new scab resistant apple that I'm trying to grow. And um, I got an apple off this yesterday. And I was happy to say that uh, even though this is the first year in the ground, so it's, uh, it's not that uh, conclusive that this apple is fully scab resistant here in Ireland. Um, but you can see that the apples look really good. There is no scab and um, You can see that it does redden up. That's where a leaf has been. So that's where the, um, the sun hasn't hit the apple So overall the, the tree looks really healthy um, the leaves Don't really have any sign of uh, mildew or or scab. There's no canker apparent on any of these branches and um, It's on M9 rootstock and it's planted here on a south facing wall. The wall's a bit ugly, but it does the job. And um, I think if I had another year in the ground here, that'd probably be a little bit more conclusive about its disease resistance, but it's got good reports. Um, Golden Delicious is in the parentage of this. I think Remo might've been the other apple, but nonetheless, I have um, been able to get a decent apple or two off this. And I'm actually just going to pick this one for you here. I tasted it yesterday. This one could probably do with another couple of days, I'd say. Uh, but I tasted one yesterday and it was very... Um, what's the word? Aromatic. So it had this... Um, it wasn't overwhelming, the aromatic flavor of it, which I've had an apple in the past that I didn't like that at all. But in this case, it was sweet, um, a mild flavor, um, but a good flavor. And aromatic so I'll take a bite and show you what the insides like it's very nice you can see the flesh is a yellowy color the skin is actually a little thicker than what you get on one of the more well-known commercial apples it's a little bit thicker than the golden delicious but it's no problem at all. It actually tastes great. So there's my quick review of the Rubella apple growing here in Cork. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, quite often I'll plant these plants and they won't live up to their reputation or they'll, they won't taste any good, but this one definitely tastes good enough to keep. And um, I'm, I'm happy to have this as part of my family of apples because of its rather uh, unique aromatic sweet flavor. And there you have it.